Hi all, let's start maths, grade 6, chapter 8, playing with constructions, subtopic artwork. Learning objectives. After this session, learners will be able to apply the procedure to draw geometric figures, construct circles, semicircles and wavy patterns accurately. Artwork. Observe the following figures and try drawing them freehand. Two circles, concentric circles, three circles such that they are meeting at this two points here and one small circle and this one big circle. These two small circles are just head and the one straight line and this here two straight lines with this small circle at a one edge so that it looks like a scissors. Do you know what curves are? There are any shapes that can be drawn on a paper with a pencil and include straight lines, circles and other figures as shown below. See, this is freehand curve. This is circle kind of this curve, which is a closed curve. This is a straight line. This is a closed curve. This is pattern of S shape. Think. Imagine marking all the points of 4 cm distance from the point P. How would they look? Try to draw it and verify it if it is correct by taking some points on the curve and checking if their distance from P are indeed 4 cm. See here, we are drawing PQ, a line of 4 cm. And then PR, 4 cm and explore if you have not already done so and see if a compass can be used for this purpose. See, take this compass, measure this is a 4 cm length. Now, keep this at this point P, circle is drawn. Construct a person. How will you draw this? This is this looks like a person. So if we observe here, it consists of this one circle and this below is this three straight lines which is like a, a kind of the rectangle and this one curve shape. So the figure has two components. One circle with a line and the here is this a rectangle kind of the curvy rectangle one side. So you might have figured out the way of drawing the first part. For drawing the second part, see this. Here we have to take this compass and draw an arc. Let us see this one in detail. Solution. Step 1. Draw a line of length PQ is equal to 4 cm. Step 2. Draw perpendiculars at P and Q using a protractor. So the, these are the perpendiculars. Step 3. Using a scale, notate point R and S such that PR equal to QS equals to 4 cm. So here you are notating R, S. This PR length is, height is 4 cm. Similarly, QS length which is like a perpendicular here is 4 cm. For reference, join RS. Step 4. Using the scale, notate O such that RO is equal to SO is equal to 2 cm. So here nothing but O is a midpoint we are pointing it out. Therefore, RO is equal to 2 cm, SO is equal to 2 cm. And we are drawing a perpendicular OD to RS. So this is perpendicular straight line you can draw with a scale. Step 5. Draw a circle with the center T and radius as a 1.5 cm. Now with center T, we are drawing a circle with radius as a 1.5 cm and draw an arc with radius Ts. So we are taking this Ts as a radius and we are drawing arc. So here we are drawing an arc. Step 6. Extend TO, erase unwanted lines, keep the required figure. Now as which of the black color are not required for us, so we are Erasing these black color lines. 
second one construct wavy line wavy wave here we need to construct this as the length of the central line is not specified we can take it to be of any length let us take ab to be the central line such that the length of ab is 8 cm we write as ab is equal to 8 cm here the first wave is drawn as a half circle so we we'll take this compass this will take here half circle as ab is this total 8 cm so we have to draw first half circle yes yeah, let us see in detail how we are going to draw this one here if ab is 8 cm ax will be half of that one so this will be 4 cm but here if this is 4 cm if this is 4 cm this radius should be 2 cm let us see now in detail solution draw a line of length ab is equals to 8 cm so first we are drawing ab as is 8 cm now take point x such that ax is equal to 4 cm and m1 and such that am is equal to bm is equal to 2 cm here sorry here bn am is equal to bn is equal to 2 cm with m as a center and radius as a 2 cm dry a semicircle and n as the center dry a semicircle with radius is equal to 2 cm so here we are dry with m as the center this radius is 2 cm we are drawing here this semicircle again with the n as the center again we are drawing the semicircle down now fill the semicircles with the vertical lines wavy wave picture is drawn as shown so here this is this wavy wave picture and we are making this semicircle filling with this vertical lines figure it out in this one there are figure it out sub questions of this based on this figure what is the radius should be taken in the compass to get this half circle what should be the length of ax solution here as ab is equal to 8 centimeters and am is it, the radius should be 2 centimeters therefore ax will be nothing but 2 times the radius therefore ax is equal to 4 centimeters figure it out question 2 take a central line of a different length and try to draw the wave on it so solution let us take now central line AB as is 12 centimeters. If AB is 12 centimeters, then AX will become 6 centimeters half of that one. But we need the radius, so AM will be 3 centimeters. So the length of AM is 3 centimeters. With the M as the center and radius is 3 centimeters, dry a semicircle. And similarly, N as the center, dry a semicircle, radius 3 centimeters down as shown in the figure fill the semicircle with vertical lines so wavy wave picture is drawn as shown here now ax is equal to 6 centimeters figure it out third question try to recreate the figure where the waves are smaller than half circle as appearing in the neck of the figure a person the challenge here is to get both the waves to be identical this may be tricky let us see solution. Let us take central line AB as is 4 cm. The length of AM is 1 cm. With M as a center and the radius is a 1 cm. Dry a semicircle. And AN as a center. Dry a semicircle with radius 1 cm. So fill the semicircle with vertical lines. So wavy wave picture is drawn as shown in the figure. Let us draw eyes. Question is how do you draw these eyes with a compass? Solution. Let us draw two horizontal line segments AB and CD each 4 cm long and a 1 cm gap between them as shown in the figure. So here we are drawing this AB as a 4 cm, CD as a 4 cm 
just per hour reference we are giving this gap as a 1 centimeter because as we need this there is a gap between this two eyes. Now let us draw perpendicular to the midpoint m of AB. So now midpoint m of AB we are notating as m. So we are drawing the perpendicular here like this which is this the top point is P. Similarly CD the midpoint is M for the line CD. Okay. So we are drawing the perpendicular here. Then with this center is this P with this radius is A P A we are drawing an arc like this. Similarly the center is a Q and the radius is a Q C we are drawing arc like this. Let us draw arc from R and S with the radius equal to P A and Q C respectively. So here similarly we are drawing with R and S as the centers we are drawing this top side of this curves. So now this curve is completed. Now with the center as a M we are drawing this first marking this with a big point then we are marking this with the dots with the color and we are erasing this unwanted lines. So therefore these lines are erased. The required figure is obtained. Thank you.